In this video, we will be going over the functions, safety procedures, and operating procedures of a drill press. The drill press is one of the simpler tools in most machine shops, though that does not mean that it lacks functionality. Because of the simplicity, the drill press is easy to use. The drill press is commonly used to make base plates for things such as robots. It is used this way because it's more precise than a normal drill. First, safety procedures must be considered. The most important safety procedure to consider is to ensure that you are not wearing anything that could get caught in the rotating drill bit. This includes, but is not limited to, long hair, loose clothing, and jewelry. Safety glasses not only protect the wearer from metal shards coming from the material, but also from a drill bit if it breaks, as small drill bits sometimes do. Once you are appropriately prepared to operate the equipment, you will need a safety key. This is usually held away from the machine by a lab instructor or other supervisor. Before drilling, ensure that the material you intend to drill into is properly marked, either by a writing implement or, preferably, a punch that will create a small indentation. Some drill press models will have a laser to align the drill with the area you intend to drill. If your drill press does not have this, you can partially lower the drill bit closer to the material to ensure that it is properly aligned. Once you have properly aligned the material, you must ensure it is clamped down both to ensure safety and the quality of the hole. When drilling multiple holes, it is essential to remain patient as trying to cut corners not only risks personal injury and damage to the machine, but may result in a full odd product, causing you to have to restart and lose whatever time savings you had. You need to properly remeasure and reclamp the material every time you want to drill a hole, and turn the machine off every time you adjust the material or change a drill bit. Once you are done with the drill press, you should vacuum up any dust the drilling produced, remove the drill bit in the drill press, and return the safety key to your lab instructor.